I am going to be playing Siamese Mahjong with some friends soon, so I want to practice. You know, it can be a little overwhelming when you first get 28 tiles and you have to make decisions with an opponent in front of you. This is a really great way to practice. I call them random pulls. If you're new to Siamese Mahjong, or if you already know how to play and just want to build your skills, consider subscribing to my channel. That way you won't miss anything. Let's do these random pulls for Siamese Mahjong. We'll just say we're the dealer, so I'm going to take 28 random tiles. Let's see what we can do with these tiles. Look at that. Look at all those cracks. Okay, so we have three flowers, news, news with three flowers, four, eight, nine. I think I'd prob probably play the concealed news hand. Let's see what we can do with remaining tiles. We've got twos, a pung of twos. Okay, let's just see here. Hmm. Oh my goodness, let's see. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, one. Let's see. Too bad we don't have an eight crack. We could play a two, four, six, eight. I might use this down here. Play two, four, six, eight. That's kind of a lot of discards. I don't think I would do that. Let's see here. Okay, what about, let's see, the twos. East and west with twos, no. We only have one thing of twos. What about a quint? Okay, there's a quint. Well, the makings of a quint. Um, that would kill the news opportunity though, because we would use all the wests. Yeah, I think I would rather play a news, the news concealed hand I think is a, is a, a strong start there. And then for the other opportunity, Let's see, four, five, five, nine, six. See, I don't think we can use those BAMs up there. I think what I would do here, I would play news concealed. And then here I would play something consecutive, maybe even a pair hand, one through five pair hand if we get a red dragon, or something around these twos. If we get an eight crack, we could switch to a year hand or a two, four, six, eight hand. That would leave eight discards. That's how I would play this. Anytime you can get yourself to eight discards, that's a really strong plan. If you would do something different with these tiles, write it in the comment section. And let's do another random pull. Okay, so definitely I want to use those flowers. So I'm thinking 
five through nine pair hand. Check this out. Five through nine pair hand. This would be the fourth hand down under singles and pairs, no gaps. That is beautiful. And then down here, I would play maybe a year hand news. Oh, you know what? We need the whites up there. Let's see here. Let's, let's wait on that. I'm thinking one, two, three, four consecutive. Five discards. One, two, three, four. One, two, around these twos. That's the strength right there. So one, two, one, two consecutive or one, two, three, four. We wouldn't be able to keep all of these. I would say we probably have eight discards, eight or nine discards, but I wouldn't pick a hand. I would hold all of these one, two, three, four tiles and just see what comes in. But I would definitely go for a pair hand right here, five through nine pair hand with dragons and get rid of those. If you would do something differently with these, right? Random pull two and what you would do. Okay, let's do one more. Okay, here we go. East and West. That's made in heaven right there. East and West with greens or East and West with twos. I think I would do East and West with twos. Wait, yeah. East and West with twos. Too bad we didn't have any more fours because we could do East and West with fours. With East and West, you need even numbers. So for the next opportunity, I would do little odds. Let's see, little odds are four, three, four, five. Let's see here. Get that out there. Okay. Um, one, three, three, five. Let's see here. East and west with twos. We have one, three, we have four, five, two, three, four, five, two, three, four, five. Hmm. You know what? I think I might even maybe try a quint here and rearrange. Quint, let's just see. Because we have, look at all these multiples. Let's see here. There's a pung in there. Two, three, four, five. And then a quint up there. I still think east and west is strong though. Let's see here. I think I would modify my plan. Okay, this would take a lot of fancy footwork. So east and west with greens, there's a gap or a quint or east and west with twos. Either way, quint wins and dragons up here. We would have joker bait here. Two, three, four, five. 
pung pung kong kong four discards joker bait I think that's how I would do this four sequent if east and west with greens come in go with that and then down here two three four five leveraging multiples and the pung so if you would do something different with this one let me know this one was a bit complicated actually but i think it's doable let me know what you think about those random pulls if you would do anything differently just write random pull one two or three and what you would have done this is really great practice give it a try yourself if you have a set at home and let me know how it goes for you if you like the video give me a thumbs up if you haven't subscribed to my channel consider subscribing click the bell when you do that way you get notification for when i post new videos and you won't miss any opportunities to learn a new strategy or maybe pick up an inside of the game that could give you an advantage at the table between now and the next siamese mahjong random pulls using national mahjong league rules may all your picks be keepers